Hey guys, how are you doing? Hope you're great, man. It's a guy's a bit more here, and uh, so I'm still at home, and uh, I'm supposed to head for school in a while, but I'm not here to talk about that. So, guys, today I wanna talk about how I overcame my fear of starting a YouTube channel, and uh, I can't believe right now in October, and. Uh, man 2018 is over like i can't believe it like just the other day it was january and right now we're in october like three more months and the month and the year of 2018 is over i kind of feel like have i achieved some of the goals i needed to achieve by 2018 okay i would say i haven't achieved them all but if there's one thing i'm so proud of myself like for a moment i sit down and i'm like yo zava are you aware you open a YouTube channel? And gosh, it's just so, so, so unbelievable because I started opening a YouTube channel in 20, I think 2017, I guess. Like, I was like, dude, you need to open a YouTube channel. You need to open a YouTube channel. 2018 came and I'm like, all over January. And I need to start a YouTube channel. And uh, it's so unfortunate I never began then, but. I'm so thankful. I mean, I had to overcome it. And somewhere in July, towards uh, the end of July, I was like, okay, I have to do this. Like, Zab, you have to believe in yourself. <laughs> so I'm so happy. And uh, so I'm here. I want to share some tips. Like, you guys need to make sure, as in, you need to overcome your fear, like, in starting a YouTube channel. And the first thing I'm going to say, man, if you have to start a YouTube channel, one thing, be yourself. And the reason as to why, okay, and the reason as to why I'm saying this, being yourself helps a lot in having a channel on YouTube. And uh, if, okay, for instance, I I don't want to wake up, I don't want to do vlogs because other people are doing vlogs. And where are they doing their vlogs? like other cool places where i can be able to afford like you guys have to check your standards personally for in okay this is an example right and uh for instance i don't want to start vlogging because i see my friends go to kfc and do their vlogs there on daily basis no that's not me like you don't want to start because your friends are driving like posh cars no you don't want to start a youtube channel because you're seeing your friend is either good at storytelling or talking to people you don't want to start because of that so the reason why i'm saying this is everyone is unique in their own way and you can't expect me to be like that person you can't expect me to be like a certain blogger you can't expect me to be like the likes of maybe jake paul the likes of moblog the likes of miss trudy here in kenya as in everyone has their own way and they have their own personality yeah and uh, the fact that you're gonna be real is you sitting down being you talking about things are more realistic to you as in what i mean by that is you don't wanna go eating at kfc so that you can please people yeah i don't know do i make sense like okay what i mean is if you're not a KFC guy or person, you don't want to do like, oh, let's go eating. So, hey guys, today we're at KFC, we know, we're going to get some drip pieces and whatever and whatever. No, you don't want to do that. Do you go eat wherever you eat, where you afford? As in, personally, well, it's not like I can say I can be able to afford, but I kind of do KFCs once in a blue moon, like literally. It's not like I earn my own money. I live uh, on being like, I be like, hey, like I live on my allowances, like whatever I get the money and I have to spend it to my fulfillment. Like I be like, okay, so this week I'm not gonna eat here. This week I'm not gonna buy this. This week I'm not gonna do that. So that's like how I live personally. So me lying to you like every day we're going to KFC darling sweetheart whatever i'm lying to you like that's not me it's like 
the typical zablon is like me going to a supermarket and grab maybe food yeah like that's me naturally like i won't be like okay na 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 so you have to be real you have to be yourself like you don't you don't want to live a life because of the living like it's too short to it's too short to fake it like don't do that so my point number two is uh, accept the reality man starting a youtube channel is not easy and the reason as why i'm saying this for instance let me give an example with me you know when i was starting a youtube channel i thought to myself that Zab, you know you have like 200 friends like i mean like contact list yeah you have like 200 friends so if you created a channel and you sent your friends the links you'll have 200 subscribers no that's not the reality bro and uh I remember when I opened my YouTube channel and sending my friends the link, yeah? And I can assure you, yeah? I sent at least, at least to all of them the 200 because, okay, out of the 200, we don't talk with all, so let's say I sent to at least 150 and I can assure you, out of the 150 whom I sent the links, only 40 subscribe to my channel, yeah? don't 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 think you have friends when you're starting a youtube channel yeah okay well you might tell them you have one but don't expect them to subscribe that's one thing not all will do that and i'm not here like bashing on them they have the right to subscribe to whatever channel they feel like yeah but they should not act as if they are fr they're your friends yet they're kind of stabbing you right on your back like Zab, 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 zab is my friend, zab is my friend, but one thing they can do, they can subscribe to your channel. Screw them. <laughs> Not in a bad way, I'm just saying. Don't overthink it, man. So, I remember before I made, okay, I used to make like short videos and uh, I would edit them, have them on my laptop, but I would like watch them and I'm like, zab, are you doing what other people do? Like, I would look at my videos and critique them like I'll be like okay I don't like the quality I don't like the sound like oh my god you have to let that go and the reason as why I'm saying this none is perfect no one is perfect and I'm gonna give an example one of the people I look so much up to let me say in Kenya for instance okay look at Miss Trudy yeah I kind of find like she's doing more of a great work. Look at her first video almost two years ago. That's when you realize, wow, everyone starts somewhere. Your first video will one of, will be one of your worst videos. You'll be looking at it and be like, oh my God, did I do this video? Like, you'll always be so, so much. I don't know, like, you, you'll always look at it and be like, okay, this is not me. So one thing, I can assure you is no one likes okay every day whenever you look at your videos it'll be like okay this is pathetic it's just like the way I take like a picture today it's my favorite I take another one tomorrow and I'm like okay this is my favorite one like I don't care about the others like so the way you move on like this becomes a new uh your new video today is like one of your best tomorrow it's like your worst so you have to cope with that and don't overthink it and if there's one thing, I, I literally listen to my voice while I'm talking on a, on a video and I'm like, oh my god, I have one of the most pathetic voices ever. I don't know. So, guys, never, don't overthink it. Just do it out of like, yeah, you feel like doing it. Like, just deep down, deep down your heart, you're doing it like for you. Like, you're just enjoying doing the video. Point number four, keep on practicing damn i'm not gonna lie to you but standing in front of a camera like i am right now it's the hardest thing ever for a moment i'm forgetting that i'm f i should focus at the lens and i want to look at myself on the eh, mirror lens thing so i have to like you have to keep on practicing yeah at times i stand in front of a mirror when i wake up and i'm like okay Zava, can you hit it and i'm like hey guys it's your boy Zabi more and uh I just say that and I'm like, oh my god, I forgot saying something like, 
Zab, do you know how much bad you are at this? Like, I stand there again and I'm like, Hey guys, it's a boy Zabi Mori and uh, if you're new here, make an effort of subscribing. Yeah, that red button. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Zab, 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 please. I don't feel you're doing the right thing. As in, you just have to keep on practicing. As in, with time, the perfection, like, just gets in and you, you'll always hit it like, you see how news and uh, the kind of news anchors do it? It's like, hey, it's Zabi Mori here. Welcome to NTV. Welcome to the evening. <laughs> Welcome to the 7 p.m. news, and today we're gonna be talking about as it, it will naturally come once you keep on practicing. And yeah, enjoy editing is as in you have to be creative in your own ways. Like, personally, I don't do so much editing on my videos because if I just do a video, I just like kind of remove the parts I don't want in terms of the saturation, color, and everything else. I'm like, okay. I'm really not gonna edit so much on that because I don't want to be perfect. I just wanna be me. Like I wanna relate. Like I don't want someone else who's gonna start a YouTube channel to look at my video, my videos, and it's like, oh, this person is like, he's he's so great. Like my videos are literally. I just feel like my videos are one of the videos that suck because as in in terms of like quality wise and other stuff i literally have no like the basis like i start with an introduction i go with the body i have a conclusion at times i feel so bad because i have an introduction for my videos and then do you know how i end it i even don't say goodbye like that's how bad i am like i just realized how terrible i need to like I need to be good in like video quality as in in the structure of my vlog like I need to start here and go here and go here and end this way like it's not like <laughs> so <laughs> I hope you guys can relate what I mean one thing people don't understand about YouTube it's like a 24 7 hour job like I'm sure okay like let me talk about me I'm usually in the matatu seated and I say something funny and I'm like yo Zab Maybe we can try to do a video on that. Like, can you sketch it down? Like, I have to get my phone so quickly. I go to my Google Notes. Like, I have to write that down because it evaporates. If you don't write, you'll be like, okay, I'll get to school. I'm, I'll get home, then I'll, uh, I'll write that down. You'll forget whatever you saw. Like, literally, you just have to get your phone, just jot it down, and just have it there, like, back up. Guys, I know it's not gonna be easy, but you have to push yourself. Like, you have to push yourself, yeah? Don't care about what other people say, and, yeah. Point number five is don't be so hard on yourself. Like, just do you, like, do you. Do according to your capabilities. Don't, you don't wanna do videos, as in, you don't wanna go, it's like you're chasing after someone, you know, as in everyone is unique in their own way. And just be easy on yourself, do whatever you can, like, it's not about how many views you get, yeah? And I'm gonna tell you this, you see, if you're starting a YouTube channel, yeah? If you're thinking about money, please, 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 yeah? Can you cut it up, like, cut it because one thing I'm not gonna lie is like for you to start maybe like for you okay the threshold that I've been given by YouTube at the moment I need to get a threshold like to attain a, a certain point like I need a thousand subscribers and I need at least four thousand hours oh my god like four thousand hours that's like almost 160 days plus of people watching your videos like 24-7 like all day without even posing 24 hours for 100 about or like 166 days if i'm really correct about that so if you're gonna start a video actually like oh and tell you for instantly no you won't be paid instantly you have to work hard passion determination and hard work that's the only thing that is gonna save you then maybe once you achieve a thousand subscribers and maybe the four thousand maybe you can be like okay now i can be doing the videos more for money like guys it's a hassle and the crazy thing about youtube is you can wake up today and start vlogging for a month 
and you have 50,000 subs you get like 50,000 subscribers and this is other person who's been vlogging for near and only has 10,000 subscribers I think that's how crazy YouTube is so one thing just be consistent consistent yeah always keep on pushing and I'm not gonna lie to you everything is gonna work out perfectly yeah so guys if you love this video make sure to give it some big thumbs up i'm not perfect though give it some big big thumbs up yeah and share with your friends you know yeah 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 yeah, yeah. tell your friend about this video yeah if they want to start a youtube channel they need to watch this video and guys don't forget subscribing and i love you so much you all watching so bye